Feel the magic. Loose for the boy then. What up, it's your boy, Debbie on Platform. I welcome to another episode of Review Stamp, okay? I don't feel too good. That's why I'm talking the way I'm talking. So, might you give that disclaimer out there, okay? But if you are listening to me or watching this video for the first time or any video on this channel for the first time, also, some of you guys just watch my videos from the recommended part of YouTube or maybe somebody may share it and you see it, please subscribe, okay? It helps the channel grow. Click that subscribe button down there to get part of the family. When you click the subscribe button, click the bell. When you click the bell, put it on, okay? So today we'll be reviewing a Wube featuring Magasco Komsa. I just listened to the song and I couldn't do a video reaction since I said like a few seconds ago I don't feel so good. So I don't feel like it's right for me to have you on camera right now. Now. This song, when I listened to it, um, in the beginning they sampled Brick and Less Love is Wicked. Okay, that's the sample they used on the song. And when you listen to the whole song, that clap, that uh, is spread throughout the whole song. And Ewube has been great at dance song like that's where she belongs, that's where she always fit. And those are the kind of songs I discovered it will be on. Not like this is the best dance song she's done before because I don't think this song still top up it. But it's a dope song. Not memorable but dope. And I understand how they were she was trying to blend the English and the French by saying you make me feel Komsa and everything she made it with Komsa like trying to sell it to the French market. She was trying to commercialize the song a lot. To me that's one of the downsides of the song. They disconnect. I hope it connects though because some kind of songs like this connect when they try to do it. It connects. Uh, yeah, Magasco's very was perfect there's nothing i can say about that again that's just it it was perfect magasco added a lot to the song we listened to his verse on the song it was just like okay this beat was made for magasco and the production of the song too was a1 it was perfect nothing wrong with the production the mixing the mastering the backups and everything was great it was just my enjoyability of this song like a piece of art I felt some kind of disconnection with the song. The replay value of this song to me is not that great. This whole thing is just a personal opinion, okay? I don't think I, I, I can replay this song again. But if I happen to stumble upon it, like if I have some friends who like it and would like to repeat it over and over, and maybe I may get addicted to it. But for now, like personally, I don't think I can go back to listen to the song. But it's dope though. For guys who like this vibe, there's nothing wrong with the song. It's just a personal preference thing. I don't feel it. So after listening to the song, and the video was directed by King Stephens too. So you guys know it's fucking clean. The lighting, the angles, the color grading, and everything about the video was perfect. So I was supposed to give this song a 3 on 5. But since he has a video, the video add a 0.5 to it. So I give this song a 3.5 on 5. If you haven't listened to the song, I'll try my best this time to leave in the description because i always get lazy okay if i don't get lazy i'll leave in the description below but if you've listened to the song tell me what you think about the song in the comment box below and once again before we leave if you haven't subscribed yet or some of you guys just watch my videos from the recommended part of youtube or maybe somebody may share it and you see it please subscribe okay it helps the channel grow so click that subscribe button down there where you click it click the bell when you click the bell put it on all that's just one hell of a job you two are giving everybody so it was your boy Delby, and i'm out